A former assistant football coach for Pickens High School hit with new charges, the details of which are graphic. The Pickens County Sheriff's Office says 29-year-old Joshua Doerr turned himself in this morning. News 13's Darren Patello joins us from our Greenville News Center. And Darren, where is Doerr now? Frank, Tammy, tonight the County Sheriff's Office tells us Doerr is still in jail. And after he resigned as assistant football coach in September, he's now facing new charges with new victims. Three separate victims, warrants, and charges. Former Pickens High School assistant football coach Joshua Doerr is being charged with contributing to the delinquency of a minor and two counts of disseminating obscene material to a minor. One man who declined to show his face on camera, but his family living near Doerr says he's outraged. And it's sad that someone would have to resort to something like that anyway to do something uh, that low. According to the arrest affidavits, Doerr sent out several lewd pictures of himself via text message. In some of those pictures, he was allegedly only wearing a button-up shirt and sunglasses. He's also accused of serving alcohol to one of the underage victims. That should never happen. On September 29th, Doerr resigned as assistant football coach after only a few months with the Blue Flame. Days later, he was charged with contributing to the delinquency of a minor and sexual battery with a student. The county sheriff's office says that student he was accused of sleeping with back in September was also among the victims in these latest charges. They also say two of the victims were students at Pickens High, the other student elsewhere in the county. There should be more checks and balances too within the school system to uh, weed out people like that to make sure nothing like that is going on. The county school district tells News 13 doors started working with the team in August. Documents allege Doar committed some of these crimes as far back as July and as recently as October. Now, the county school district tells News 13 that Doar was never a teacher but did go through orientation, so should know the policies against sleeping with a student. Also, he's on trespass notice, so if he ever came onto county school district property, he would be arrested. Live in the Greenville News Center, Darren Botello, News 13.